Welcome to MonroeMotors.com. Here we have a 2011 Jeep Grand Cherokee. Beautiful machine, black metallic, leather interior, passenger power seat that you see there, clean as a pin everywhere, nice looking machine. Navigation that you can see there, I'll show you more of that in a sec. Here are the books and the original window sticker of the vehicle right there. So Grand Cherokee Limited in black metallic. So, let's go over this and have a good look. There you've got nice cup holders in there, uh, power windows, power locks at your fingertip right there. Uh, touch buttons here to lock the vehicle, so that locks it up when you're away. And there's the chrome looking great in the back seat. Uh, luxury design, and with it you have uh, power, pardon me, heated seats that you see down there, and then uh, adjustable air vents right there. So a great vehicle, lots of room in it, nice fold down armrest, and of course those seats both fold down where you'll have even more room. Tires on this are Michelin's. Wheels are in great shape, I'll show you the next wheel in a sec. In the back here then we have the uh, power tailgate button there. We have nice little cargo straps for hanging up your groceries on. Great little spot to store things there. And then under here, mammoth storage for the spare tire and then some extra room on the side there to store some other things. There's your subwoofer for the stereo system and then hooks for more grocery bags and then a power outlet for plugging things in at the back for accessories. So this one has, again, the power tailgate, which I'll just show you there. While we're waiting for the tailgate to go down, you can see that happening. That it also has a uh, dual exhaust and trailer hitch with trailer wiring already installed, ready to go. You also have a feature on this vehicle where you can uh, double click this and then the window will open so that you can have partial access, or, <coughs> or excuse me, hang things at the back, <coughs> whatever you choose, excuse me. Rear wiper washer, you've got the antenna up there, and a roof rack. So let's go down here and have a look uh, at some more over here. Here's the front wheel in great shape, Michelin tire, looking fabulous. Under the hood, we've got the 5.7 liter V8 Hemi. That's an iconic engine for Chrysler. It's done so much for them. It's got lots of power, pretty decent on gas if you don't boot it too hard. And if you do, well, you were having fun anyhow. Uh, clean, clean, clean under the hood there, as you can see, looking fabulous everywhere. Nice looking machine. We'll close the hood. Not a lot of chips on it. You might see some in there somewhere, but let's have a good look at the, at the hood as we go across. Yeah, I guess there's the odd little chip there. Nothing major. As I like to say, you drive it, try not to get a chip on it. It's nearly impossible. Someone's going to happen somewhere sometime. So there's the other front wheel. Uh, in, again in great shape, Michelin tire there as well, and we'll slide down here to the back, check out the other wheel, it also looks great, Michelin tire in the back seat here, again as I said these are fold down rear seats so they fold flat, so you have a full fold flat in the back floor, so that you can carry things, you've got cup holders in the back as well, um, let's have a look at the front here where we've got memory seats, so you've got a cup holder, power windows, power locks, power mirrors there, nice little bit of wood grain. And then over here we've got the uh, power, pass, power driver side seat with multifunctional adjustments with the lumbar, etc. And then we've got auto lamp system and fog lamps. There we go. Uh, over here, let's climb in and we'll fire this one up actually. Let's do that. It's a push button start. You can see that through the wheel there. When it starts up, it has memory settings, so the wheel comes down, the seat will come forward to the setting that you've set it at. It's got 123, 143 kilometers on it currently. Nice vehicle. Um, there we have the telephone for Bluetooth and voice commands. There we've got the uh, rear wiper, front wiper, intermittent wipers. Over here we've got the volume, pardon me, the cruise control over here. And on the back of the steering wheel, back in here, so let me see if I can show you. There's the uh, volume button there, so you'll see volume control being adjusted there. And then over on this side is station adjustment over there, so there's another button back there. Okay, so down in here we have uh, more buttons and features. So that's our telescopic, tilt and telescopic, up and down. So that's all power working there. Awesome. Over here we have the navigation um, with 
backup camera. Let me just show you the backup camera. So there we have the backup camera and the power tilting mirrors. So the mirror tilted down when I when I put it in reverse and tilts back up when I take it out. Up here we have all the controls. First of all, we have a sunglass holder and then we have the controls for the sunroof and the tailgate. So the sunroof currently is in uh, tilt mode and then there are two roofs, a front and a back. So I can close the back like this and then I'll close the cover on it and then I can close the front by closing that and then pushing there again and closing the cover. Sorry, closing here the cover. There we go. So it works perfectly there and then opens up once to the first sunroof and then opens up to the second sunroof when you push it again. So you have a full panoramic roof, really nice for driving around on the beautiful days and enjoying that sunshine that's out there. Down here we have the iconic uh, Jeep 4x4 where we have all the modes, the four wheel low, you've got sport and snow and sand and rock and all of those iconic features available there. We've got tow haul, haul buttons there, and we've got a heated steering wheel, we've got a 110, inch, 110 volt power outlet, and we can turn off the backup beepers over here. We have fully automatic air conditioning with heated and cooled seats. So this is the cooled and heated seats. And then our automatic air, we just set the temperature to whatever we want. And we have dual zone air so the driver and passenger can have two different settings. Up here we have line in for our radio and our phone is all there, all the buttons. It's just all set up very easily as any Chrysler would be. Have a look in there and you'll see the door frames are looking awesome. It's a really nice clean vehicle. Just a gem of a car. So <clears throat> there it is from this side. Good looking truck. Great machine for going up to the cottage, going skiing in the winter. It's an all-purpose, all-season vehicle. With the 5.7 liter V8 Hemi, it's like a four-door Corvette. Got a nice little rumble to the exhaust. Can you hear that? There's our backup sensors in the bumper. And again, from this side. So there you have it, folks. 2011 Jeep Grand Cherokee Limited here and available at MonroeMotors.com. Come on down and have a look at this one for yourself. Hey, I'll see you real soon.